Go. One one percent power. <laughs> Should do for the rest of the year. If you happen to stay in the mystery machine, it inspires you to say things like zoings. Hey, what's going on, YouTube? This is your boy King Gabe here, and uh see as I can um see, uh seems like there was a lot of a lot, lot of views on the uh, on the Scooby Doo um, the the season one finale uh, review of the Scooby Doo two thousand two movie. Um, very impressed with that there, and not only there but also um, any of you that have TikTok and you know if you follow me on TikTok uh, you'll probably notice um, a picture I put up 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 on TikTok and it's I think it's, it should be posted in my community tab here, but. Um, it was a picture of uh, the Scooby Gang, the original uh, Scooby Gang, the meddling kids, you know, teenagers, uh, meeting their counterparts from a pup named Scooby Doo. Uh, it's a really cool picture, by the way. It's a fan art. Um, matter of fact, someone on TikTok even told me that this actually was done in a Scooby, um, I think like Scooby, uh, I forgot what they called it, but it was it's a Scooby comic where they sort of did a parody of crisis on infinite earths which pretty sure that probably was pretty good because scooby you know <laughs> how could it not be <laughs> well well using the originality of scooby um yeah some of the new stuff that's coming out with scoob uh, well let's just say they've gotten to the point where they've even asked scooby out of the picture <laughs> you can't really call it scooby if you don't have scooby and not to mention the other stuff that's in it, but we ain't going to get into that. Um, so anyway, um, so yeah, a lot of attention on that as well as the review. Um, so I thought this would be a good time to tell you guys about um, the history of Scooby Gabe. No, you're, pro no, you're probably like, what the heck is he talking about? Well, let's just say... Um, Growing up as a kid, you know, now we know Scooby came out like in the 60s and everything, um, 60s, 70s and all that, way before I was born. I was like, I was born in 1988. Uh, matter of fact, 1988 is when a pup named Scooby-Doo first premiered from 88 to 91. So by the time I was like in elementary, I saw reruns of a pup named Scooby-Doo along with, you know, the other Scooby iterations, you know, like the original uh, the Scooby movies, um, Scrappy and Scooby, even the one, you know, where they had Scooby Dumb, kind of insulting, but it was, I saw even the 13 Ghosts a little bit, and a few, and a few little specials that they sort of had out with them, little bits and pieces of them, I remember. So anyway, um, not really much to it, but, um, there was a time watching all this that I imagined myself as my own version of Scooby-Doo, known as Scooby Gabe. <laughs> um, I think mostly kind of around the third grade, I want to say. Maybe a little bit of the fourth, uh, but most of the third grade. Because fourth grade, I was kind of, like, then I was sort of um, really high into Garfield. As far as, you know, the comedical interest there. So, not saying I wasn't into Scooby-Doo either, but yeah. But at that time in third grade, yeah, Scooby was pretty high of my interest level. Um, and the most, the thing I liked the most out of all the Scooby-Doo stuff next to the original was a pup named Scooby-Doo. So I imagined myself <laughs> a pup named Scooby Gabe. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, not, like, again, not really much to that other than just picture of myself and, you know, the Scooby-Doo episodes I would see on TV and stuff like that. Um, I, ma I imagine uh, a few kids from my class back then as, you know, Fred, Daphne, Bilma, and um, Shaggy, of course. And, of course, yours truly, Scooby Gabe. Um, <laughs> there was, a, you know how Scooby always eat the Scooby snacks? Well, um... No, I did no, I did not actually eat dog treats. No, I'm, I'm not saying <laughs> I didn't go that far. And trust me, even I'm just don't click away. 
Even if, I thought, because you know kids will do weird things growing up. Some some kids, depend, it all varies. But even if I had a thought of that, uh, no way my folks would have would have let that fly. Because they were like, hey, don't you eat that. That's not for you. <laughs> yeah, so, but, you know, knowing that, um, I always, you know, the, the snack food called Dunkaroos? Well, I always imagined the... Uh, Dunkaroos as um, my Scooby Snack. <laughs> Scooby Gabe Snack uh, would be the Dunkaroos. Um, so that's, uh, I always had those in my lunch bag around that time Dunkar as my little dessert. Um, I actually saw them not too long ago. They, I don't know if, uh, I don't know if it was limited time, but they, but it was, it was brought back uh, at one point. Um, they had got a few, tried them and everything, still like them. Um, uh, however, uh, then there was, uh, another thing I imagine as my Scooby snack. Um, and I don't know if any of you ever heard or had this, the, can't pronounce that name. Uh, it starts with a W, but it's a butter toffee candy. Uh, my grand, my big pop and I, we used to always would, uh, you would, you know, you put them in your mouth and you suck on them and everything. So or like peppermints or, or, or another another thing, another candy that you suck on. Well, pretty much it's 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 the candy you suck on in general. But um, we would always uh, have that. You know, we always pop one in our mouth around the house, especially when we got ready to go for you know walks around the neighborhood. There, uh, it was sort of our thing. So yeah, I used to bad there was Scooby Snacks. Yeah, uh, <laughs> every nose. Um, I actually. <laughs> There actually was one time I accidentally choked on that on that one time though, uh, yeah. But I I was able to get it out though. Oof. I was kind of thinking of that, but anyway. So yeah, um, that's pretty much what's the most of my Scooby gameness. So, um, so yeah, it was um, yeah. Imagine myself as Scooby Gabe, yeah, and. Uh, um, yeah, probably, I think that's pretty much all I can think of, other, you know, imagine myself in Scooby episodes, so, <laughs> um, that's pretty much it, and also, and as well as, you know, the other Scooby iterations, so, um, so, uh, just wanted to share that briefly, real quick, that's what I did on my phone, cause, you know, not, um, wasn't a lot to say on it there, um, so, if you like so you like that as well as also my Scooby Doo review from earlier? Yeah, definitely like, share, subscribe. You know, uh, share with your friends. Get some of our available comic books and support us on Patreon. We definitely could uh, use that. And also follow us on the other outlets like Facebook, TikTok, Twitter. <laughs> yeah, um, not as um, I would say Instagram, but I don't really do Instagram. Uh, also, there are some groups that we do have on Facebook. Um, Miracle Comics on Facebook, as well as also Yu-Gi-Oh! Shock and Friends. Yeah, so there's two Facebook groups I have up there, along with my original Facebook account, you know, Gabriel King Gabe Johnson, so... Or Scooby Gabe. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> so, so, yep, check all that out, and uh, as well, uh, see you next time with uh, another video. Uh, as we're um, going to be getting ready for the first review of Season 2 in a little bit there. So, you're going to be in for a surprise on what that review is going to be. Cause it should, uh, we should have it out um, some point next week, that review, to start Season 2. So, until then, take care, everybody. And also, um, yeah, Season 2 of the Royal Talk. And also, comic more comic updates. So, see you later.